Okay, you may hear a little bit of office noise in the background here, but I've got the uh, BCD-436, as you can see, it's scanning a list that I just did a straight pull from the FCC database, 20 mile radius of our office, about a little over a thousand channels that it's scanning. Uh, I've got it set so that it'll only stop on digital channels, so when it stops on a yeah, channel, I'm a materialist, like now, uh, Justin from there, see what happens. See the color, the slot number, and then the uh, during the voice, you also see what type of system it is. So if it's a capacity plus, you'll see CAP. If it's a connect plus, you'll see CON. If it's just a conventional DTR, you'll see, uh, excuse me, if it's a conventional DMR, you'll see DMR. Um, and some of these are just uh, some data burst channels, so you're not hearing any voice but uh, occasionally you hear voice. So I'm just gonna let this run a little bit and uh, let you see what it looks like and a little bit about what it sounds like. That's a capacity plus. Now if I wanted to see... If I wanted to see the uh, talk group information, I would uh, capture the information I'm seeing here uh, as far as the frequency, the color, and the slot, and I would program those over into a uh, DMR system rather than a, a conventional type. I'd program it either as a DMR uh, one channel or as one of the different, uh, or as Moto Turbo for either of the flavors of Moto Turbo. And then we would start seeing uh, talk group IDs. But in this mode, you see, you get enough information to program it into then a trunk system. We are here trying to log in. Receive, if you would start for Eaton and Stratford, Texas, Adam Zebra 4, 3147. Adam Zebra 4, 3147. You're putting a track that comes all the way into the middle of the road. Where is he? Let us see. 